Before you begin, use the installation guides to verify that you have all the contents required for this installation. If anything is missing, please contact Promethean Technical Customer Support. Perform a risk assessment to safely assemble and install this product. You may require additional help. First, remove the locks from the active panel box. Squeeze the plastic tabs together on the front and back of the box to lift the cover off the base. You may also unscrew the metal locks on the sides to slide the box off the base. Next, determine where the active panel will be installed. If you are installing on a hollow wall, please use a stud locator to find at least two studs. Now, refer to the installation guide to determine the measurements for the active panel, mark the holes, and drill. Make sure to use appropriate wall anchors that will support the combined weight of the active panel and the wall mount. Also, make certain you comply with local building codes and guidelines. Next, install the wall bracket. Use the screws from the back of the active panel to secure the two vertical bars onto the active panel. Note, the wall bracket may be an additional accessory not included with the active panel. In that scenario, please follow the instructions that came with your wall mount. Install the vertical mounting bars on the back of the active panel. If you have purchased accessories, please install them now. In this video, we will install only the Promethean Chromebox and Wi-Fi module. To install the Promethean Chromebox, loosen the safety screw on the side of the bracket on the back of the active panel. Remove the rubber trimming on the Chromebox to expose the holes underneath. You may discard this part. The mounting screws are in a separate bag in the box. Attach them to the chrome box to mount it to the bracket on the active panel. Now, place the Promethean chrome box on the bracket and tighten the safety screw to secure it. Connect the HDMI and USB cables on the Promethean chrome box and plug them into HDMI 2 and Touch USB 2. There is also a power cable that should be plugged in. Press the power button on the device. Insert the Wi-Fi module into the active panel in the smaller slot under the OPS slot. Now attach the antennas. Tighten the screws on the unit to secure it. Next, use safe lifting techniques to mount the active panel on the wall bracket and secure it. You may also use a safe mechanical lift if one is available. Once the active panel is secured on the wall, attach the safety screws on the wall bracket. There are two of these, and they are located on the underside of the two vertical bars. Our image is shown from the bottom of the active panel looking up. Now, plug the power cable into the active panel. The power switch is located near the power cable. Switch it on, and a red light should display indicating the active panel is receiving power and is in standby mode. When the active panel is turned on, the light should turn white. Once you have seen the home screen and gone through the initial setup, the installation part of the active panel setup is complete. Be sure to make the user guides, pens, remote, and other accessories available for anyone to use. You can find more information about the Active Panel Element series on our support portal. Thanks for watching.